You can use the reshape tool in Illustrator to create sort of Christmas ornament shapes or vast other shapes. So I'm just going to quickly show you a quick and easy way of creating an ornament design. Just going to start with a, just a simple line. Just create a line there. And now I'm just going to go to the reshape tool. And I'm just going to go to about the center. Drag that out. Then hold down the Alt, release, release the mouse, release the mouse, and I'm still holding down the Alt, release the mouse. Right, now I'm just going to go the other side, release the mouse, release the mouse, release the mouse, and that's that. Right, that's the basic design for the ornament design. I mean, obviously, you could add additional bits to it. And I'm now going to use this. I'm just going to add using the variable width profile up here. I'm just going to select one of those. OK. So once I've done that, you can see it sort of looks more like maybe an onion as well. But it's a sort of ornament design. So I'm now going to use the live color feature. And I'm just going to go there, live paint bucket. and just going to click on one of those and it's going to come up with a message complex visual anyway click OK and now I'm just going to go to the swatches just going to fill that area so I'm just going to click there red just going to go along it green you notice you actually have to go over to the side so it's not actually it doesn't actually go for the area so you actually when that highlights you can actually just fill that there. Rather, it's not. I'm just going to go to the next one again. Like I say, you just have to select that one. Be nice if actually it worked in the centre, but unfortunately, it selects that one when you're in the centre of the other one, which is not so convenient. Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. So, right. So I've done that. Created a quick easy ornament design so you could add additional features to it but that's using the live bucket as well as the reshape tool to create a sort of Christmas ornament design and now of course once you've done that expand that and you can then drag that over to the symbol part just going to delete that now and I'm just going to then just add things and of course I can just create multiple ornament designs, resize them if I wish, rotate them, just basically symbols that can be changed. And I've also created one earlier, very similar sort of design. So I'm just going to drag that out. So quick ornament, Christmas ornament designs, as well as onions or multiple coloured ornaments.